Closet Use, and today we are making this sweater wine bag. Does this sweater look familiar? Yeah, I used even more of it. There's nothing to whine about when you make this one because it is easy. The supplies you'll need for this craft are an old sweater, contrasting yarn, an embroidery needle, a glue gun, scissors, and the best part, wine. Tis the season for holiday parties, and what way to be a better guest than to bring a bottle of wine in a cute bag. And in the wine bag game, it gets tough. There are those tiny little Santa hats, those tiny cute Christmas sweaters, but you're gonna be the winner when you bring something that you made yourself. First step is to measure how much of the sweater you're going to use. I used the front panel of the sweater from the collar to the bottom so that I didn't have to worry about fraying edges. And then using the wine bottle, I perfectly measured how much to cut out because I'm good at math and rulers and stuff. Each piece is 12 inches long by five inches wide. Then I took the hot glue gun and glued each side together. This is important because it will make your addition of the yarn that much easier. And if you have two different pieces of fabric, you can also whip stitch the bottom. Then you are going to thread your embroidery needle with your contrasting yarn and whip stitch the sides of this puppy. This is gonna be a lot easier because you hot glued it. You're welcome. There's nothing that complicated about a whip stitch. You're basically sewing a circle and inching your way up the fabric. When you reach the top, do a couple loops and then tie it off on the inside of the wine bag. Then you're gonna repeat on the other side. Then you're gonna insert your wine oh so easily. Take some yarn and tie it around the neck of your wine bottle. And voila, how cute is that? Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you're making this stuff, let me know. Hashtag DIY Dammit, DIY December, and show me your goods. Then go buy my